guys I went on a street run last night after I got out of work the video was made but it was all blurry so I canned it <laughs> I didn't want to say the dirty word so I have nothing to do today I decided to stay home get myself a cold refreshing drink and relax a little bit and then I got to thinking good lord I'm bored there's nothing to do on this damn thing so I got to looking around and I was looking at these and I thought to myself fat guy why are you only getting 60 cents a pound for these? Are you being lazy? Indeed I was. So I'm going to show you my way to turn this or this into plain old brass for more money. Alright, stand by. So you might say well, fat guy, okay, so you know, I haven't sat in there fooling with this stuff. Flathead screwdriver, Phillips head screwdriver, prying and pulling, messing around with these. And I was actually, I went out to the van, was going to go to Menards and get myself a Dremel tool. While I was in the van, I looked at these. And I wonder, hey, do you think I could take this and use this to get it? Let's try it. What's this? What do I hear? What about this? Now this is a thin one, granted. But look at, watch this. It cut right through it like butter. Now, they're not all going to be like this. Okay? Some are not, so... Let me throw my glasses on. But now that we have that, we can separate this out. That's pure brass. Right there. Pure brass. All we have left is this rubber crap on the inside, which comes right out. There's your other piece of brass. Trash brass. Sixty cents a pound. Buck thirty a pound. Clip this one. Same thing. Just grab my flathead screwdriver. Get in there and pry it a little bit. See that? And this pops right off. Brass. Squeezed it. Pull the garbage out. Brass. Now, there's going to be the naysayers, I think. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. That say, but fat guy, <laughs> how are you making any money doing that? simple. I'm doing it because I have nothing else to do and 
in the end it's going to pay off. There's one other kind that I've noticed that will take a little more work to get to. But this, even this isn't that hard to do. So this end, you can see that's a little thicker. These do not like to cut through it. It'll cut through part of it maybe, but So that's difficult. So what we can do is just cut into this. Let's make a little cut up the side. Till we get to the skinny section. Okay. I should hold this part be easier. It's like my extra uh, my extra special heavy hand. Now let's pry it. There we go. Got that piece off there. Now you don't need then to cut any more of this or to get rid of the rubber. This is a whole piece of brass. Done! Let's see. This piece. Lighten that out. Look at that, the rubber curled right up. Brass. It's worth it, guys. It is worth it. I mean, I've been finding these left and right. And believe it or not, even though wintertime heads around, you find those in the wintertime in the garbage too. Grab those. Have yourself a pair of these. These things kick ass. They cut cords, they've cut through brass. Look at, they cut right through brass. I mean, yeah, it's a little effort, but good God, who the heck wouldn't want these when you can use these to turn this crap into money? Wise investment. Just, and if they go to crap on you, get a good pair. These are. Stanley. No endorsement. Just Stanley. Get you a good pair of these. For the street. Yes, in your, you know, wherever you're at, your storage unit, your garage, your, you know, your pull bar, whatever. Get your complement of tools, but for street. And you know what else? While you're on the street, now that I think of it, if you have these with you, and you walk up on a on a garden hose and boom you can leave the rubber in their garbage you don't have to bring it home with you you can load up a, a little bucket <laughs> this a little bucket or here this is what I've been loaded up with look at this nature's touch it's an ice cream bucket It does not take long to fill this up with those. All right? All right, guys. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I appreciate all the new subscribers. I'm going to go now. My love to all of you. See you in the next video, guys.